Speaking of hard dicks, man, why do we continue to give Jack like Jess a platform? Like, what is the, like, what's like the, again, I like the guy, but what am I, I like missing him. there, man? Well, because I don't understand, like, the play, like, what, like, what exactly is No Jumper trying to get to, like, whenever we invite on, like, like, like Jack like Jess? Well, first of all, when you say speaking of hard dicks, and that's a transition, is yeah. that because Jack, like, just makes your dick hard, or? Hard dick tr transition. Oh, man. <laughs> Bro, like the puns We keep, got bars, fool. The, the puns keep rolling, man. We got man. bars. Hey, transition, Jack, like, just hard dicks. <laughs> the puns keep... No, right? No, but, like, apparently, you <laughs> feel me? And he likes, you know, the transitional hard dicks. Yeah, yeah. Hey, you know what? Like, the the, the, the funniest thing to me, and I, and I like Jess a lot. Yeah. I think he's a cool ass dude. Of course. And I think that to answer your question, the mm -hmm. reason why Adam has Jess on is because he is a content gold mine. You know what I mean? Like he Nah. Pff, bro, his stories are absolutely it's the first insane. Time, no, see, 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 right? Here's the thing, right? About like the menstrual show or like or like kind of like the like like the first time, like the fuck shit and the foolery. It's like a surprise factor to it. Like, oh my God, this dude is buffing. He loves chicks with dicks. Cool. <laughs> then about the second or third time, bro, like we stopped caring, right? And and I feel like this last time, like we like 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 we saw that niggas ain't really give a fuck. Well, well to to me, <laughs> and I've said this multiple times. Yeah. I'll reiterate it again. The least interesting thing about Jack like Jess yeah. is the fact that he likes a little bit of a. Uh, <laughs> pickles in his taco you feel me like 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 to me that is not what's interesting a little bit is crazy <laughs> well he and he dumped his trans girlfriend because she dump, wouldn't his girlfriend dump her. dumped him well, well he didn't dump her no sure but though that thing ended up splitting ultimately that thing. <laughs> pause Ultimately, because pause. yeah, pause. Ultimately, because she wouldn't pause patrol, top him or put dick in him. That's not why they broke up, fool. Yes, yeah, yeah. I'll pull it up. Okay, yeah, no, please. I saw the clip that of, of what, yeah, but play, yeah, play that clip, please. Right? No, hold on, Jack. Like Jess, yeah, we gonna get to right. the bottom of this, homeboy. Yeah, not nah, listen, man. I'm just like, why is no jumper a hip hop platform? Continuing to platform it when it has nothing to do with hip hop essentially, and like there's no, like there's no story there, right? Like, well, okay, the, the the first part I agree with. The second part, no, there's well, definitely a story there. Like, what's the story? The story there is there's this kid that grew up in a predominantly white part of Long Island with a father who was in a biker gang and was running around doing all kinds of crimes from a young ass age. He told that the first time though. No. Correct. I mean, like. So, what's the story he now? Does have, like, like, like I said, his sto his story is essentially if the the TV show Euphoria mm. was directed by Quentin Tarantino. Okay. You know what I mean? Like, he has a fascinating person to chop it up with, and he's very like unhinged. But like, I understand. Like, like I think this is something that people talk about all the time. No jumper, mm -hmm. and this is the same thing that people mm -hmm. admonish Adam about when he interviewed. Um, yeah. What what's his name? The dude that uh, was P Pop Smokes. Oh, we gonna get to that. Yeah. So like, yeah. P because No Jumper is a a, a platform known mm. for elevating people to the next mm. level. Yeah. People have the expectation that everybody that's on this platform is somebody that Adam wants to push. Push. No, listen. It's not necessarily the case. No. Hey, listen. I'm not saying the story wasn't there, right? The first time he came, he told a story. Yeah. The second time he came, he expounded more on it. So the story was already like wrapped up. Now the third time, it just sort of seems like a shit show. Like, right? Like it just came across as why? Yeah. Right? Why am I turning on and no jumper and hearing about him sucking a nigga dick? I, I feel like the gay fantasies, the gay, like, erotica, right? Like, the homosexual. That was wrapped up within a first two. Why do I have to listen to it for a, a third time? Like, why are we platforming this for a third time? I, I, and to me, like, ultimately, that was not my decision. Of course. You know what I mean? Like, do I feel like Jess yeah. 
deserves to be able to tell his story and do i think that he's interesting absolutely do i have a problem with adam bringing him on the show hell nah but ultimately he should come listen russell look i, I like jess and feel like jess should come and just podcast and just talk about oh yeah for sure the news and trending topics and fit within what's going on but bringing jess on like to force feed this trans shit for a third time down our throats is kind of like pause. Uh, so, do you feel like is this basically? Yeah, is no jumper a part of the the trans agenda? No, are, they, are, we, are we trying to brainwash people? No. So okay, so but I, but I've seen a lot of people say that. Yeah, right. Like like him on and bring on a trans girlfriend. It just feels like a shit show. Like more so than yo, I'm tuning in to listen to Lush One, like. Give me an analytical deep dive about these, like, you know, like this real nuanced hip hop takes and hear Adam chime in and, and feed all of you, right? And then hear Brick give his, like, cool stories. I'm not tapping in to hear this nigga talk about dicks again for the fourth time. Man. Like, like, it's like, nigga, like, right? Like, again, if we all like him, because again, because again, I like the guy. Yeah, he cool. Yo, come on and talk about, yo. Drake and Kendrick. Right, right. I feel like you, know? you look. Yeah. Honestly, I had about 20 to 30 more minutes about the Eminem album. Yeah. And I really. Absolutely. I really wanted to be able. Like, I was. And I get it. Because Adam and Adam and Brick really disliked the album. Oh, okay. Gotcha. And, but I wanted to give a really deep analytical take on that, which I didn't feel like I was able to do within the time constraint. However, like. Do people really want to see that? I, you know, ultimately that's Adam's decision. I don't know what he wants. No.